Hi guys, I'm Jennifer Tapier backstage at The Voice at the press conference catching up with the winner Chris Blue and Alicia Keys right here on So Delicious TV, the place to be. Chris, your song, we loving it. Money on yeah, you. Yeah, man, money on you. Yes. Is fire, by the way. Fire, yes. By the way, it's not Boy just some fire. like cheesy little like that's a joint. Yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah. Is, okay. is that the kind of sound, Chris, that we can expect on an upcoming album? Absolutely. In the future? Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Stuff that makes you feel good and, and, and enjoy life, and and that's kind of what you know. You know, coach has been kind of preaching to me this whole season. Make sure you produce something that you feel. Because if you don't feel it, no one else will, right. you know? Straight up. And so when I heard the song, like, I don't know, actually before I heard the song, funny story, um, I, 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 uh, I got the text message and before I opened it up, I knew it was the one. Mm. And I said, that's the one right there. Once again, there was a second song. I chose the second song. Right. <laughs> and, and he said, you know, he was like, now, I do like that song, too. It's good, because they were both very good. Probably that one would be on the album, too. Right, right, absolutely. Um, absolutely. And he said, and, and he was like, but I, I really, there's something about this song that really speaks to me. And I said, you know, let's give it a second. Let's break it down. Let's play it on the piano. Let's like really hear the structure of the song. Let's really make sure. And I sat down by myself, and I did that. And sure enough, the song he picked, I was like, he's right. It's the better song. And, and so again, you know, it's, it's, it's just great when an artist knows what they want. It's very important for his career. You but know? you know, and, and, and that's like, that's big props to Alicia because she could have said, no, I'm the coach and we're gonna do what I wanna do. We're gonna do what I feel we should do. And she didn't do that. She said, no, I trust, like she trusted the trust that we have between each other. Yeah, and and that sure. was special. That's so real. thank you. Sure. Thank you Thanks so for much. having a good instinct, because if well, you didn't have a good instinct, I wouldn't be able to do that. <laughs> <laughs> Attitude reflect leadership. There you go. Oh, yes. <laughs> Don't we like him? Don't we really, really like him? We do. Congratulations both Chris and Alicia. Thank you. Chris, you kept telling us week after week that you almost didn't audition. Crazy. So true. Crazy. So true. When you heard your name, what flashed? Through your in your head. Tears? I don't think I could see. Like I couldn't open my eyes. <laughs> I saw darkness and just like water, and then my eyes started to burn from the makeup. But <laughs> um, but wow, I, you know, I, for a second there, I began to think about you know that moment. I was in my car driving to Atlanta, and fear began to overtake me. Um, so I called my fiance at the time, actually, and she taught me into to just go and just try it and my mom and my family they always believed in me and so I was like well I mean hey if they don't like me I just won't tell anybody that I came down here to drop on the voice this never happened people they weren't there right they, they, won't, right. Know. they won't know right, it's cool. so I stood in that line of seven to ten thousand people wow. and um, got a call back wow. and from there we got another call back and then another call back. And then all of a sudden, when you blink your eye, it's like, you're the one of the voice. Crazy. <laughs> so By the way, it was not that fast. It was super hard. It was very it's hard. So, yes. such hard work. It's such hard work. It's so rigorous. Like, their schedule is very, very, very rigorous. It's almost hard to imagine how they can sing as well as they can because when you don't get any sleep, which is normal actually for an entertainer anyway, but when you don't get a lot of sleep, you know, it's very hard to keep your voice excellent, you know, so, so it's always impressive when you're hearing them sing, like, especially last night, three and four songs, and of course, none of them slept last night. The night before last night, you know they didn't sleep. Nope. They were like, oh my, so, it's, it's, a, it's great. I'm so happy that you ain't turn around, too. Uh, I'm so happy, too. And for everybody else, whoever wanted to turn around, you know, because yeah. we all have wanted to turn around, so. Oh, that's preaching right there. That is. Yeah. <laughs> they, Blake was talking about getting to church. I might. 